Hey guys. Hi everyone and welcome to today's adventure here in Blackpool at Blackpool Pleasure Beach. Yes, this is going to be a fun one. We've been invited here by Blackpool Pleasure Beach to do the media day for 2023. So excited. It's the first time to come and do something for them. So we're super excited for today. Yes, loads of stuff going on today as well. Big Dippers, 100th <laughs> yeah, anniversary. Sorry. You've been checking that map out all the time, haven't you? We've also had a bit of a game on the way here, trying to get Ollie to find the, the uh, Blackpool Tower. That, that went oh, well. That went well. Like that uh, direction that there, way. like over there maybe? You're looking too far, look, look forward more. Like that way. Like that, right there. Look, that way. Like diagonally that way. <laughs> that, look out that way, you don't there, over daddy's head. Can you see it? Can you see it? <laughs> Can you see it? Can you see the tower? Like there. Like right there. Can you see it? You can't see it, right? <laughs> oh, I can see it! That's our media day, we're going to take you through. Have a great day here. Welcome. Let's go. Feels like quite a long time since we've been here, actually, to be fair. When was it? Is it... I think it was two years ago. Two years ago. I was like, wow, everything so far. Yeah. The accomplishment today would be if we managed to get hands of Valhalla and Wallace and Gromit for me. Yes, you're going on Valhalla. You have to do it. <laughs> well, that's why you're looking at it. Look at that, Ange. You're a good vlogger, you, aren't you? So, as mentioned at the start of the vlog, this is a media day, so it's not like your typical day here in the park. The whole idea behind this is that Blackpool Pleasure Beach are trying to showcase to everybody what's coming for the 2023 season. So, main things are Big Dipper, as yeah, I mentioned before. Yeah, and wow. I've, I've never been on it, this is going to be my first time on it now. Yeah. Um, we're heading on that now. We've got an exclusive ride time before the park and it gets open to everybody to have a ride yeah. of that. I'm excited so, to take him on it. Yeah, so it should be good. And then we need to go on Valhalla because that's open up again this year, don't we, Ange? Yeah. Fully refurbished, brand new. Got to try it. Yeah. Even though I hate a lot of rides, I'm going to do it. Yeah. And then we've also got a character brunch where we get to meet SpongeBob and he's and he's me. SpongeBob, Squidward, Chasing Sky. There you go. Yeah, those are Paw Patrollers as well. So we're going to show you that. And then we get a little bit of time to do what we want to do. And we're going to go to Hot Ice. So yeah, quite a packed day to be fair. Yeah. Oh, what did you think of your first ride on the Big Dipper? What? Loved it. You all right there? I just hair's a bit crazy now. <laughs> Can you believe it's a hundred? A hundred years crazy. old. Yeah, it's doing well. It's looking good. That was so much fun. Did you love it? Yeah. First time on it. And we've been here all the five minutes. And we've lost the group. And we've lost the group. <laughs> I think we're gonna send a search party out for us at some point. So we have been informed it is scheduled to rain at some point later on today. But Blackpool Pleasure Beach have been very kind and said, we've got ponchos for you. Which I'm happy about because now I don't mind going on that pillow so much. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, that's, that's true. But the park is very quiet to begin with at the minute. It's currently just turned 11 o'clock, so half an hour since the rides have opened. And it does seem pretty quiet at the minute. So it's only supposed to be the big dipper that we got an exclusive ride on, but it just brought us around. So we get to meet Blue Flyer as well, which Ollie is very excited for. Right, Blue Flyer is over and done with. Now we've got like half an hour yes. to run around and explore before we get to go for our character lunch. Yes, so we're going to try, try to go on Wallace and Gromit. It's going to be one of the best star rides in the country, right? One of. One of. So, uh, it's in my top three. Yeah, yeah, I'd say that. It's in the top three. Don't worry, John, we got you. Um, right, okay, let's go. Head on, hopefully get on there, Wallace and Gromit. Hopefully. Come on, shark you, shark you. Really quiet here at Blackpool Pleasure East today. We've queued up for Wallace and Gromit. And literally, uh, there must be about 20 people in front of us, and that's it. And it's 12 past 11. Oh, yeah. 
Oh god, such a good ride. Genius blocking you in so you have to show love through the shop. I still love these water bottles. <laughs> so good. Tell you what, if you come to Lockpool and don't go on that ride, you are missing out massively. Yeah, it's such a good ride. I love it. it. It brings back so much nostalgia from childhood. It really does. Well, who is it? Is he on the case? We're coming to the big pizza kitchen, which is an all you can eat pizza and pasta restaurant. And I believe we're going to get to meet some characters. Are you excited to meet the characters? Yeah, and the pizza. Yeah. We have gone some pizza, some pasta, some salad. Oh, yeah. And so far, the food's really good. The garlic bread is delicious. Yeah. Even garlic bread. Really good. Good, yeah. That's what Ollie's gone for. That's what Gaz has gone for. Why do I seem to have the biggest plate? Pickled onion. <laughs> Ooh, you, your breast going to smell lovely now. <laughs> Very pickly. <laughs> It's got a crispy bottom and it's dead lion for me. No one loves a soggy bottom. So something new that they're trying for this year is a character meet and greet here in the big pizza kitchen. And right to the side of us we've got Ollie eagerly anticipating Spongebob and Squidward. Okay, so all out of big pizza kitchen. It started raining outside and we've been given ponchos. Well, we've only got adult ones left, haven't we? <laughs> hey. It's a little bit bigger than me. A little bit bigger. Okay. But do you know what? You're not going to get wet on my power. <laughs> You're right there, mate. Yeah. <laughs> you should be all right with that. Yeah. I just want to say, the Blackpool Pleasure Beach have been absolutely amazing today. So good. They've been such a good event. Yeah, they're doing such a good job. And again, I just want to reiterate for anyone who's watching, don't take this day as like a normal day. It is very much a media event isn't it, that yeah. we're doing. So yeah. I just want to make that very clear. Um, but we now have the rest of the day. So you can be normal guests. Yeah, you can be normal guests, do what we want. Yes. There's no like fast tracks or anything like that now. The only thing we've got is the hub, which we'll go in a bit too later on. Which is where we started today, yes. and then we've got highs to be played. We have, we have. Looking forward to that. I've not, don't know much about it. No, but, we've never seen it. No, so. but I've heard good things. Very good things. Yeah, so we should go yeah. now and uh, get the most out of the park. What do you reckon? Yeah, should we go ride uh, Streak in the Rain? Streak in the Rain. All right, there. <laughs> yeah. Drowns you just like it drowns him. I know, I'm going to have to tie the sides up or something. <laughs> <laughs> the rain really is coming down now. And we're going on a roller coaster. Yeah, that's why Poncho's coming on. <laughs> you broke the streak. <laughs> Did you enjoy it? Yeah? That was the weirdest experience ever as you're going up the lift and I look down and I can see the floor through the carriage. That was weird. And you said, what was it? That the, the bar moved separate yeah. to the seat. Yeah. It was like, oh, okay, that's a bit different. It was a proper old style wooden yeah. roller coaster. So that's three wooden roller coasters today. Yes. We think it might be too small for Grand National. I hope so. Find my out. bones are rattled now. <laughs> Let's go see if we can get some more rides. Oh, my God. So we have finished in Nickelodeon land now and we're heading outside before we'd have a quick look to see if he's tall enough for Avalanche. And surprisingly, he is 112 with an adult or 132 without. I'm really surprised at this one. Yeah. Again, have you done this one before? Yes. I've just done it before once. Yeah, yeah. Catching you up on threads now, and yeah. Is this one a thread? Oh yeah, it's a roller coaster. It's a bobsled. A bobsled coaster? Is it bad or all of you think of? It feels very good. It feels all right. Everybody. It's Bob Slick. I didn't know you were going to say it. Did you know? <laughs> and now we are going to watch the matinee performance of Hot Ice. Ice. So we are not able to film Hot Ice. 
we shall tell you all about it when we get back out because I'm super excited for this one. Aren't you? Really excited. Please turn off all cell phones and remain seated throughout the performance. Thank you. <laughs> oh, hot ice, what do you think? What was your favourite bit of? Come here, come here. Come back here. Come back, please. My favourite bit was... What was your favourite bit? The big finale piece. Oh, oh, That's right. what I was trying to say. The, the, the snow one. and bubbles. And the, the snow finale. and the bubbles and the finale. Yeah, yeah. yeah I liked the uh, Tango the Partners one. Yeah, that was good. I really cool. liked like lifts. <laughs> <laughs> like, watching them lift each other and throw them out and stuff. And the Battleplate guy, he was cool. I know why it's called hot ice. Why? Because there's a lot of hot wax used before the stuff. Oh my god. It's so it's not tiny, so it's it must have been waxed. So many legs so it must have been waxed. I mean, it, it was a, a bigger spectacle than I thought it was going to be. Yeah, there's like so many pretty costumes. Yeah. There's a lot of, a lot of like, production that went into that. Yeah. I was really surprised. I think it's high quality. Oh and if that's included in Park Commission, I don't know if it usually is or not, I'm not sure. Um, I shall leave it up there if there is a price involved. Um, it's sure the difference is coming near it at a theme park. And that was in a theme park. Yeah. It's crazy. It's showing it, I saw the theme park. Yeah. Are you okay? He's, he's busted to go and do more rides. He's like, no, come on. Plus, plus we let him have like quite a bit of chocolate in it though, so go. <laughs> Why shouldn't anyone go on the ghost train? There's lots of um, jump scares. There's lots of jump scares? Yeah. yeah. So, what age do you think the ghost train is suitable for? Not kids. Not kids? <laughs> no. no. Did you not like the dip though? The dip. The dip. Yeah. It's the guys from Hot Ice with all their abs. Out on show. Okay, so it might actually end up being a premature ending right now. I thought that was fun though, it wasn't, it was a no, coast train, we're all right. lightning and everything. Right yeah, now. exactly, so all the coasters the rain are stopped. But we're hoping that Valhalla will still run. Hopefully. We're going to head well, over. Anyway. Yeah, exactly, we're going to head over now, give that a go, and then hopefully the rain will subside. But from what we've seen, it doesn't look likely. No, I just think. I don't really fancy those roller coasters with the rain like smacking your face. Smacking your face, needles in the face. I don't know. It's been a cracking day on tonight. Yeah, it's been really good, hasn't it? Yeah. Really good. I said, Gan, this is not a half an hour journey. Like, yeah, it is. How are you feeling about this, buddy? Yeah. Proper shoes. We're getting cold now. We've only got two shoes, so I'm going to get cold. However, it's going to be worth it if we get to my pal power. There is a man with a vacuum, vacuuming water at a beach boat going past. That's how much water is on Valhalla. I always say that, but it really was. I mean, there was a bit that I thought we were losing only halfway through. It just smacked us from the side, and we went flying. He came Assessed us. He <laughs> got inside you. <laughs> Boom. Let's have a look. Ollie, let's have a look at damage. Let's have a look. <laughs> it literally, because we were on that side. Spin round. Spin round. Spin round. Let's have a look. <laughs> look at his butt. <laughs> I feel like you got the least what? I mean, it was all in the face. I got the, I got the least one. No, you definitely didn't. <laughs> <laughs> I think I got the most wet. Are you ready for this? Ready? Watch. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Oh, 
So, first impressions of Valhalla, what was your favourite bit? My favourite bit, the last yeah. drop. The last drop? Until that big bang. Yeah, that the big bang, it splashed. What was the worst bit? The worst bit. Probably the second drop. The second drop, that was the steepest yeah, one, wasn't steepest it? One. Yeah. I think the first one's going the most, because I thought it was getting bigger yeah, than it was, wasn't. and I was like, yeah, <laughs> but it's so dark in there you can't really make out everything that's in there, can you? But like when you, that thing came from the side, just wallop and literally just nearly took you and blind, didn't it? Yeah. Just as a warning for I people with contacts, it goes in your eyes. So that brings the end of today, the media day for Black Door Pleasure Week 2023. Thank you guys for inviting us. Oh, it has been yeah. an awesome day. We've had a we best time. Loved it. Haven't we, Rod? Yeah. It was so good. Until next time. We'll see you on the next adventure. Catch you later. Bye.